We encountered quite a climax on General Hospital this week, and everything changed in Port Charles. Parker was fired from her job, and Christina decided to move to Oregon with her. Curtis continued to put the pieces together, prompting several questions. Griffin had some doubts of his own, and he ended up sleeping with Ava. And as certain secrets come out, next week will be a whirlwind. Fear the spoilers. Sam makes a bold decision about her future, which will end up altering every friendship that she has. Patient 6 makes some strides of his own, connecting with people in a way that surprises many of them. Another relationship will also be strained when Nathan starts to worry about his marriage. It's the close of a captivating chapter, and the start of something exciting. While we wait to watch, here's some soap opera news that you may have missed. People say that soap opera worlds are small ones, with the cast of characters finding themselves in sordid situations almost as often as they can speak. While the real-world counterparts to these states of affairs might not be quite so scandalous, the industry is often composed of the same several faces. That's most evident when it comes to casting decisions, and a recent one has set the world of daytime drama alight. Greg Rickart, best known for his role as Kevin on The Young and the Restless, has reportedly joined the Days of Our Lives roster. Specific details about the move have yet to be confirmed, but reports suggest that the actor will still make appearances in Genoa City, even as he finds a new life for himself in Salem. This is yet another in a line of so-called casting coups by the long-running serial, which will be bringing General Hospital star Tyler Christopher into their numbers, in addition to longtime running favorite Allison Sweeney and even Eileen Davidson. It looks like it's true what they say about the world of soap operas. It's a small one after all. Well, it's finally the end of the week, which means that it's time to relax. So sit back and join me for another one of Tiffany's Fashion Fridays. Seeing as how she's the wife of a mob boss, I can't imagine Carly ever leaving the house looking anything less than impeccably well put together. She went out this week in a burgundy v-neck dress with an asymmetrical peplum. It was designed by White House Black Market, but is sadly out of stock. However, we can offer you a similar match by AX Paris. You can find this sheath dress on Amazon for only $24.99. With soap styles in mind, whether you break the bank or go for the bargain, you'll be as scintillating as your favorite soap stars. Okay folks, the moment has arrived. It's time for our weekly giveaway. Every Friday we choose a random person who has shared our videos on Facebook and we send them an official Soap Hub money basket. This week our lucky winner is Jessica Sanabria. Congratulations Jessica, we'll be reaching out soon so keep an eye on your inbox. For everyone else, don't worry. You can still win next week. Just make sure you share this video, then tune in on Friday to see if we pick your name. That's all for today, everyone. But don't leave just yet. We want to hear from you now. What did you like most about this week? What are you excited to see next week? Share your thoughts with us in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe on your way out. Also, if you want a chance to win $5,000, take a quick trip to theprizeshow.com. The link is below this video, and sign up now absolutely free. As always, fans, thanks so much for watching. I'm Tiffany Hegebo, and I'll see you again soon.